everyone. It is January 23rd today and it is a Monday night and I thought I would just check in with you guys and show you what I'm working on. I've got my campsite shawl right here which, sorry I just started in a row. Could have shown you a little bit better. But um, I've got quite a bit done. I'm nowhere near close to being done but I feel like I've put in a lot on this. Um, but I really kind of want to get this done. I've had this on the needles since September and I'm just getting kind of put on the back burner. Um, so I really would like to get this done. Uh, but I love it. It's so soft. The um, yarn is a haiku, simplicity haiku. And um, but yeah, it's really, really nice. This is in my um, bag from Tracy. It's so cute. Um, Tracy is um, specialty sewing on Etsy, but she had sent this to me, which I thought was so sweet. Um, the other thing I'm working on tonight is my Madewell, which I don't think, I know I showed this before, but I don't think I showed how much progress I had on it. Let's see if I can do this one handed. Just pause. So here's my Madewell. Um, I have stopped in a really random spot, like right into the row. <laughs> So it's going to be kind of hard to show you, but um, this I really also want to get done. I think this is what I've had on the needles the longest. Um, I started this back in July, so I just really kind of want to get um, a lot of my stuff done and not have as many things on the needles. I used to think that I wanted like all these projects on the needles, but I think it just stresses me out. <laughs> so I think I'm going to try and um, and get some of them done. like. I think right now I have I have two scrap blankets, which I don't really count, um, but then I think including the scrap blankets I have eight whips. And that's just too much for me, so um, I think I'm going to try and get it down to three. I know a lot of people do that, um, or it seems like at least. I hear that a lot. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm so excited to have this. I know it'll be a while. Um, I did order, they should be coming tomorrow, um, some 9 inch circulars in a size 4 for the sleeves so I can do my sleeves on circular needles which I'm really excited about. And Because um, I, I really like using 9 inch circulars um, as long as it's stocking up, which this would be obviously. So let's have my um, spinning wheel up. I was practicing my spinning tonight. Um, and just really, really into that. I'm uh, currently watching um, the Woolen Spinning Podcast. And for anybody that is um, wanting to get into spinning, I really recommend it. Um, Rachel is cut off. Um, but as I was saying, Rachel's a very um, technical spinner. And she's just really enjoyable to watch. I learned so much when I watch her. And um, I still have so much to learn as far as spinning. But I've really got the bug right now. And... Um, I really, really want to do more of it. So, um, still want to go through that yarn texture book. So cool, but I just haven't had time to like sit down and go through it. So I've got a couple days coming off. Um, so I'm really hoping to go through it then. But yeah, so I just, um, oh, I have another project right here that I didn't get to show before. It's in my little bobbin sock bag, and. I meant to show this before. This is um, a January sock that I started. And this is um, spun right around in the candy colorway. And I did the vanilla is the new black heel. I don't know if you can see it. It'll probably be easier on sock blockers. It's a really interesting heel. I can't wait to try it on and see what it's like. See how it fits. But um, this is almost to the toe. So then I'll have one of those done. I also, um, if you see on my Instagram, I don't have it nearby. But, um, if you see on my Instagram, I finished um, one of my hand spun socks. So, I after I finish this one, I will have finished three separate socks in the last month. So maybe I get a pair done soon. But so yeah, um, that's all I've got for now. Just wanted to kind of pop in and say hi. Um, I haven't, you know, videotaped in a bit. So recorded, listen to me videotaped. But um. So I hope you guys are well, and I'm hoping to do an actual podcast very soon. Um, today's Monday. I'm thinking Thursday I might be able to, So, um, but maybe I'll get this uh, vlog up before then. But I hope you guys are all doing well, and 
um, go check out the Ravelry group. We have that basket of mittens along um, that's going on for the whole year. We have Battle of the Brioche knit along. Go check it out. Um, the Battle of the Brioche is going until February. I can't remember which date now off the top of my head, but everything's in there. But um, I'd love to have you guys knit along with me and, uh, and uh, all of us that are, that are knitting brioche. But um, I will talk to you guys later and I will leave you with Ella snoring on the bed. <laughs> you were tired, girl. Oh, do you want belly rub as hell? Oh, stretchy girl. Sleeping? Huh? You sleeping? You say hi? <laughs> oh, there's a girl. <laughs> I just want to go back to bed. <laughs>so I'm just out um, in the backyard here taking some pictures for some yarn that I dyed up that's gonna be in the shop very soon um, today's Wednesday um, 25th I don't remember what day of the week or what number it is but today's Wednesday and um, these should be up in the shop by tomorrow I have to work tonight so I don't think they'll be up tonight but um yeah they should be up tomorrow on Thursday and I thought I would show you um, what I've got Okay, so here's what's going to be in the shop tomorrow. I've got blueberry crumb cake, which we've seen before. And then I've also got a new colorway called Mulberry Jam, which is this really pretty red purpley color. It's a really pretty tonal. Um, I think it'd be a really good color in a shawl. I also think like a cardigan out of this would be so much fun. I might have to do that. <laughs> but yeah, you can tell I've got like a, a sweet theme going on. <laughs> But yeah, so that's going to be up in the shop. Um, it should be tomorrow. Tomorrow's um, Thursday. Um, but if it's not, it should be very, very soon. Um, and the shop is the woolenhomestead.etsy.com, which I will have links below in the description box. But yeah, so that's, that's what will be up. Um, that's all I've got. And then I should be podcasting tomorrow on Thursday. So you'll see, see some more of what I've been working on. But um, I hope you guys all have a lovely week, and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.